قَصَمْتُ الصَّلَاةَ بَيْنِي وَبَيْنَ عَبْدِي نِصْفَيْنِ I have divided the salah between myself and between my servant in two equal halves. وَلِعَبْدِي مَا سَأَلْ And my servant shall get what he asks in his half. When the servant says, Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen, this surah, he has said it is the salah. Why? Because the Fatiha embodies everything about our religion. It summarizes the relationship between Allah and us. And that is really what our religion is all about. And what is the purpose of the Salah? The purpose of the Salah is to remind ourselves of the purpose of life. And that is why Fatiha is called the Salah. Three for Allah and three for the servant and one that is the connection between the two. And that's the beauty of the Fatiha. Three verses are for Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The first three. The last three, dua for the servant. And the middle ayah is the linkage between Allah and the servant that is Iyaka and Abdu Iyaka Nastain. And we'll come to this, that's the whole purpose of our entire uh, tafsir. So, what does the hadith say? Allah says, One my servant says, Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. I say, My servant has praised me. So, Allah is happy. Allah is happy that my servant has praised me. When my servant says, Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim. Then Allah says, My servant has repeated his praise of me. Athna Ali Abdi. Then the servant says, Ar-Rahman Ar-Rahim Maliki Yawmiddin. And Allah says, My servant has glorified me. And when you say Maliki Yawmiddin, so Allah says, My servant has given me exaltation. Then the servant says, Iyaka Na'budu wa Iyaka Nasta'een. So Allah says, this is between me and my servant. This ayah is the link between me and my servant. You alone do we worship, O oh Allah, and you alone are the one whose help that we seek. And by the way, even in this, there are two statements. Iyaka na'bud, and then Iyaka nasta'in. You alone are the one whose help we ask. And then the rest of the surah is a help from Allah. Ihdina salat al-mustaqim. Sirat al-ladhin amta alayhim. Ghayr al-ma'udubi alayhim wa أبدا لا لن نحيد أبدا لا لن نحيد أبدا لا لن نحيد عن خطى الإيمان